This is a video on using the screen capture tool in Smart Notebook. Some of you may already have the camera icon in your toolbar. In that case, you can just click it. If you don't see this screen capture icon, you can always go to View, Screen Capture Toolbar. What that's going to pop up is this little box with the four options. This one with the dotted line means that you get to pick the size of the screen that you want. This one will take a photo of your entire screen. This one will take a picture of a specific window that you have up, but it will take a picture of the whole window. And this one will take a picture where you can make it into any shape that you would like. Similar to this one, but this one makes it into a neat box. This one you can make it into any shape. Usually this is the one I use. So I'm gonna click on it. Now you see that my screen got darker. This means it is ready to take the screenshot. I'm gonna click and drag on the part that I would like. I can send it to a page in Smart Notebook or I can do something else like save it on my computer. If I wanna take a picture of something on the internet, before I click my screen capture toolbar, I'm gonna open up the page that I want on the internet. Now I have the page that I want up and in my view, I'm going to click on this button and I'm going to click and drag my mouse over the spot that I would like and let go of my mouse when I am ready. This time, instead of sending it to a page in Smart Notebook, I'm gonna to go to do something else. Here my options are send to the current page in Smart Notebook, save on your desktop, choose a save location, so that means save it in a specific folder or send to clipboard. Send to clipboard makes it something that is now copied and that you can paste. Right now I'm gonna save it on my desktop. And if we look here, it has its own folder, but it should also be in the folder on my desktop. I hope this helps.